W what is Valiant? Anybody have an idea what it is? Company. Well, what it uh, but what is it like? What does it mean on a deeper level? Like value wise, what are we focused on? What do we do? Well, we don't know, right? None of you can actually just give me a flat answer. That's that's a big problem, right? We should know what our values are as as a team, and we, and we don't know that. We're trying to get to a point that we can figure that out, and that's been the problem, is we've been successful across stage one, not as successful in stage two, and we're kind of just riding the wave of like our wins and losses, and that's not what we should be as a team. We should be a team that is driven by values and driven by a culture, and we haven't done that, and that's organizationally and within the team itself. So at the end of stage two, we kind of came to a head where it was, uh, you know, team atmosphere wasn't in a great place. Um, obviously, the losing didn't help that at all. And then kind of knowing that there was going to be some changes was a little bit more of the hopeful piece on, on our end. Let me lay it down right now, and I know I've spoken to some of you about it. The only determining factor of you being on the main stage is your skill set and the level of effort you put in. That is what will determine your, your play time, okay? And I know the coaches think they're in agreement that if you're putting in the effort and you're showing the skill set that we need, you will be playing. Any concerns about that? I want to make sure that I'm transparent, not for the sake of being transparent, but this is the, the mission that we're trying to accomplish here. These changes aren't going to be things that are going to like instantly click and there's going to be some challenges, it's going to be frustrating. But in the long term, that is what the vision of the team should be, that we can all step up and do that and fulfill a particular role. Okay? One, two, three, listen. Break time, break time. Let's go. I don't want to think about the stage two. I want the more better stage three. I just think it's stage three. Coming into stage three, obviously, with Space starting. My name is Indy Halpern. My in-game name is Space, and I just turned 18. And then uh, bringing in Custa from Dallas. We knew that they were going to have an immediate impact. Custa, he's really motivated and want to win. We have your, uh, your inaugural Valiant jerseys, gentlemen. <laughs> Oh, there you go. There you go, guys. Hey! Uh, when when you you've got new people on any roster, like you make a good um, a good motivation. During this week break, I think we started to realize that stage three was going to be a fresh start. Oh, big three behind you! Practice has been much better. Everyone can agree on. We focus much harder and we fix mistakes in the moment rather than you know, going on them. So I think that's been a big improvement. This goes to everyone. Like once we've been a team fight, we want everyone to kind of immediately switch to thinking to, okay, so now I, gotta, I can put pressure in this position or I have to be in this position and then take over this area or something like that. Yeah. Instead of like saying that. Hello, my name is Christopher Grimreality Schaefer. I've recently moved to the assistant coach position from being a player. I think being in a, a staff position really allows me to kind of like fulfill my mission, just really being that like energy resource that amplifies the team's mood, uh, brings more like positive vibes. Did you talk to Indy, his pace before the game? Was he nervous? No, he seemed pretty calm. Uh, you know, I didn't really expect him to be nervous. I gave him a little pep talk, but I mean, he seemed pretty chill. I was definitely excited to finally play. It had been a long time since I competed, and then I didn't feel nervous, but when I got up there, like in the beginning, I definitely was nervous. It took a little to focus and really get into the game. I remember one time specifically, I, I hooked Zenyatta off the map. He's walking in with the whole hog, goes for the hook, and Kido. And I could hear people like, like ooing, like during that, that play, and I was like, kind of got me hyped. I think he's just an all around solid player. Uh, he knows you know, when to talk, what to say. He knows how to lead, and he also knows how to, to listen uh, to someone else leading like fate or something. All in all, I, I think he's generally just kind of lifted up the mood a little bit, made everyone feel a little more comfortable, kind of like a, like a family, like a team, you know? Wings up? No, no. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> just watch you do. How'd you think you did? 
So so. so, so. Not, not as good as I do in the scrim. <laughs> so I'm still getting used to the environment for sure. Good job, guys. Thank you. Please give it up for the player of the match, Space. After we won 4-0 and I had my post-game interview. I'm looking forward to the future with this roster, and I think we have a lot of potential. My dad was actually in the crowd watching, and I knew my mom was watching from home, so I was kind of nervous, like, talking in front of all my family. Oh, that one, thank you so much for joining me. Yeah, I'd always talked about it with my parents, but they had never seen it, and then to see it in such, like, a, a magnificent win, like my grand debut, and they see us 4-0, and I get the player of the match, was, like, all amazing. We had a great start with Seoul. I think as the stage goes on, we're gonna have a lot more cohesion coming in with our roster, with uh, with Custa and Space especially. So once they begin to gel, I think we're gonna have a very successful run. And then obviously with our full 12-man roster, we'll be able to develop a lot more of that talent and you might see some new faces on stage. This is the best start we could have asked for. Like a four all off bat against Seoul is a really strong start for us. And especially with our next matches coming up, we're definitely feeling confident. Um, so this is a question from Twitch. This is for soon. What has been your favorite experience in LA so far? In and out. Listen. <laughs> 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 <laughs>